And what do you and your family do to cut back on plastics? Uh, we uh, uh, we have uh, recently switched to drinking uh, water bottles out of uh, water out of uh, when we have water bottles. I was just wondering, how are you? <laughs> is, that, is that your word? Is that your question? Yeah. Just how am I? Yeah. What kind of professor was I going to be? I had to decide. Please save all your questions until the end of the lecture. Thank you. Judd Nelson won't come out of his trailer. Christian Slater won't go back into his trailer. How many sugars do you want in your coffee? Stop asking me things! Is this an official break or are we taking a five? No! Oh! And welcome to AHA Slides Q&A feature tutorial. To use the Q&A feature, first click on New Presentation. Give your presentation a title and create a unique access code so that your audience can find your presentation easily. Then select your slide type, which for this tutorial is Q&A. Enter your heading. We'll use the standard Ask Us Anything. Then choose from the following options. If you want your audience to be able to send a question at any time, tick this box. If you only want your audience to be able to ask a question at a particular point in your Q&A, tick this box. We're going to let people send a question anytime they like because people often have good questions but forget. Do you want your audience to be able to see each other's questions? Tick this box and of course why not? Let's give it a tick. Will you allow anonymous questions? Tick this box and for the purposes of this tutorial we will. Finally, what reactions do you want your audience to be able to use? And there are the standard heart, happy face, like and dislike. We'll leave these blank for now. That's it. Now we'll go over how our audience can get involved. Have your audience connect to your presentation either by scanning the QR code or entering your unique access code in their web browser. The option to ask a question will appear on their phone like this. If you've allowed your audience to ask a question on any slide, then this is how it looks on a slide that is not a Q&A slide. For example, on this multiple choice poll. If they tap ask a question, they will be able to 1. Enter their own question, 2. See the questions that have already been asked, and 3. Vote on the questions they would like answered the most. For this example, we'll ask the question, can you tell me more about the Q&A feature from AHA Slides? And submit. You can see it's now showing in your presentation live. Next, you need to decide how to deal with this question. You could answer it, or you could pin it for later. To do that, just hover to the left of the thumbs up and click pin, or go ahead and answer the question and then mark it as answered. You can also browse through the questions in a few different ways. You can sort by the most popular questions by clicking on top questions. Find your pinned questions by clicking on pinned. Find the most recent questions by clicking on newest. Or find the questions that have been waiting the longest for an answer by clicking on oldest. You can also revisit questions you've already addressed by clicking on answered. This is particularly handy post presentation when you want to collate your audience questions and pinpoint room for improvement in your presentation. The easiest way to do this is to export an Excel file. To do this, click on results and then download an XLSX file. Give it a file name and select save. When you open that up in Excel, it should look something like this. 
It's worth noting that you can also customize the background of your slide. Click on background and then either upload an image or select from one of the hundreds we have on file. With a pro account, you can also take the customization of your presentation a step further by adding a logo and changing the font. Just click on branding and you'll see both options listed below. And that's it, you've created a Q&A slide, collected a whole range of interesting questions from your audience and made the Q&A section of your presentation much more simple and effective. Thanks for watching and thank you for choosing AHA Slides.